And the first PSA, Blunty, people have asked me about this recently. Uh, I thought we had this issue fixed. It's come back up again recently, and I haven't had a solution, and I've just been telling people, sorry, there's nothing you can do. I literally had done that 10 minutes before you, you, you told me this solution was out there. I had told someone, sorry, you, there's no, and I was like, really? Um, so what is the issue that this fixes? And then we'll talk about what the fix is. All right, so if you've got a pair of V2 goggles, somebody even mentioned this in chat already today, this is happening enough. So um, if you have a set of V2 goggles and you are not using a DJI FPV drone or you haven't updated in a while on those goggles, they have a bug where if you're in DIY mode and you're flying the air units or the vistas and then you leave your goggles on um, and plugged into a battery and they lose, basically they lose power from that battery losing voltage. Mm -hmm. Sometimes, it doesn't seem to be every time, but it seems most of the time with certain batteries, um, they will reboot into the FPV racer drone mode, not the air unit Vista mode. And right. when they do that, you can't switch back. There's no you option to switch back. You can't switch back. back. It's, not yeah. even, it's not even in the menu where it normally would be. For yeah. some reason, running the battery all the way down confuses them. Yes. And then the, the other problem is, so there used to be a firmware you could flash. This is the solution that used to work, but the problem is that DJI have gotten rid of all the old firmwares because they want to. They want you to flash to the 0015 firmware version that locks out the root hack. Yeah, because they don't want you. They don't want the root hack and, to exist. Yeah, and if you happen to have a DJI drone, it also blocks that NFZ hack and the mm -hmm. power hack for the DJI drone, not the yeah. units and vistas. But um, so yeah, if you. Basically, if you don't want to go to that firmware, because that was the only solution, right? Um, if you don't want to go to that firmware, instead, you can use um, uh, this uh, website called Dank Drone Downloader. And this Dank Drone Downloader will, mm -hmm. will give you a 0001 version, which is the version that fixed this issue, but it right. doesn't have the lockouts for the roots or anything like that. Yeah. Now, this will, you download this. How does this work, Blunty? Because you can't flash the DJI goggles. Like, you can't just flash the DJI goggles, can you? So what does this do? Um, no, so basically, yeah, you, you take this and then you use the drone hack software. So the oh. drone hack software um, lets you flash a legitimate version for free of a DJI firmware. So you basically, the drone downloader downloads the real firmware file. I and then see. The drone hacks uh, program lets you flash that firmware file to the goggles, so you don't have to flash to zero zero one five. You can do zero 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 one. I instead. see. So Dank Drone yeah. Downloader just archived this old firmware somehow, and now yes. they're giving it to you. This is not this is not a custom firmware that they made. They've just Correct. got it. And this then is the legitimate you, firmware for the V two goggles on the right. racer side. Yeah. When you combine that with the Drone Hacks app, you can flash that firmware outside of the DJI architecture, and uh, yeah. GMI Visual says this is old news. Madstech mentioned this ages ago. I don't think this exact fix did. Uh, I this yeah, just not that I'm aware of, but uh, maybe he did. But I have okay. tons of people every day who contact me and have no clue about this, including you, who also did not know about this. So we're I did not know news. about this. this. A PSA, yeah. so our viewers can find out about. It. Well, the the issue, the problem. I think what Madstech probably talked about was the old solution, which involved flashing that old firmware via the DJI Fly, the DJI um, FPV Assistant app. But ever since yeah. the 0015 firmware came out and they got rid of the old firmwares, that didn't work anymore and people were screwed. And people, Correct. and by the way, yeah. thanks to the community, because uh, I kind of, I'm not going to say, I'm not going to say anything rude about DJI, but this bug exists. DJI haven't fixed it. And now they got rid of well, the fix that they did yeah. give us. And I was going to say, I, yeah, they f they fixed it, but they're just like, if you want it, you got to take it all. You I can't see. Get part of it. So the yeah. 0015 firmware does fix it, but you can't have the root hack and all the other stuff. So I guess that's yeah. fair. Fair play, DJI. Yeah. Fair play. I mean, still kind of a dick move, but fair play, I guess. Yeah. Um, alrighty. Uh, that's that. If you run into that, tell, share that. Share that out into the world because people are being affected by this. And um, we should also say thank you, Blunty, to yeah. Junus. Um, yeah, Junus is the one who let me know about this. Junus, the guy who did the original FPV out uh, uh, hack and got the you know the original magic bit figured out. So he shared that to me. So yeah. All right. Thanks, Junus.